Hello ladies and gentlemen, it's Marty Torres here, aka Sex Energy Goddess 13. And I wanted to come back tonight um, because I was thinking about Music Monday and I was telling you guys about Music Monday on the last video and I got so excited that I didn't finish talking about my lineup, um, which it turned out perfect because I wanted to take the time to make uh, a special thank you to young Simba King Lion and to Sean Dawson. These are two people that have stepped up to VIM 3D Radio and um, they decided to really like push for their passion and just go for it. And um, I commend them, I commend them in um, having the discipline to do what it takes to like really go after what it is that you want. And I love seeing that in people. I love seeing that in you. I love that we are connected. I love that we just fit right in and everybody knows what to do. And um, it's it's an exciting time. Um, you can check out Young Simba King Lion, Sounds of Liberty is his show. And um, in his show, you get to know what this young man is about. He is a warrior god king that is full of knowledge and full of zest and passion and he's ready to raise the vibration of the planet he's ready to do his mission and he is he is so dedicated to it watching him is is exciting it's, it's exciting for me to watch you young Simba it is and I love being a part of your journey and I remember you and I know that you remember me um, I also want to say to Sean Dawson oh Sean Dawson Okay, so last November, or last December, I was on my sabbatical, and and um, I was on my sabbatical at Miss Smokey's house, and for the first time in my life, I felt my brother who, um, I think my brother's been transformed now, gone, dead for, um, oof about yeah about 20 something years now and my brother was a homosexual a transsexual and in December when the image of and the energy of my brother came he wanted me to do something to elevate um, his energy and it really was like a scene from Ghost um, I felt my brother on my right hand side and he kept showing me pictures and my um, my children's dad was there when this happened, and he was actually telling me that he remembered him. And it was it was it was something that y'all, if if it didn't happen to me, I couldn't even say that I would believe it because I I, I live my life pretty much based on experience, and I listen to other people's stories, and I could appreciate that. But I can't say something unless I know it, unless it's happening to me. And for me to experience my brother, and he wa he wanted me to do something for him. And you know what he taught me and what he said to me was that people, when they are when they when they are past this realm, that when you think about them and you think about them in high energy, it helps them elevate and it helps them ascend. And it's like my brother, you know the 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 spirit of what my brother was. It's like he was a gay person in this in this vessel when he came to this realm but where he is now he's just an energy you know so it's like he wanted that to be understood and he wanted um, he wanted me to represent him in some way and Sean Dawson is a film director a producer an artist and she um, she has these amazing documentaries and I definitely am proud to host them at VIM and you know it made me feel a little bit emotional because in this moment is when I recognize that I am honoring him in working with you on this project and um, because for a long time I kept thinking he kept coming to me and I was saying what am I supposed to do I'm busy with you know like I gotta do like where where you know I didn't know how I was going to be able to do that for him so I always definitely have him in my prayers and meditation um, but you know I'm realizing now that just the awareness that you bring 
is just another sign to all of this, just another level of knowledge, another level of understanding, understanding, overstanding, which is really the only thing that we have to offer right now. This is not about judgment. None of it is. I know that some people feel very strongly about, um, you know, about homosexuality, what they think is right, whatever. You know, it's like, for me, I connect with everything as energy, and I recognize the masculine, and I recognize the feminine, and I recognize the people that are in between, and I recognize that, you know, because of all of the things that have happened in this universe, those things, things were created. I mean, so many different programs were created, and um, the more knowledge that we have, the easier it is for us to navigate in this realm and really be able to focus and picture what it is that we truly want when we start disconnecting from everybody else like it's not your business it's not you know be you're privileged to be able to to witness the story you know but it's like when people want to start giving their opinions of what they think that you should be or what their belief systems are whatever everybody has their own bubble and everybody has to do them everybody came here for a reason it's like even the worst person that you can imagine you know what I'm saying? It's like they're playing their role. They're playing their purpose. Everybody does it. There is no death. There's only transformation. So you get to experience whatever you want to experience. You get to do that here. There'll be a time where you're not going to have a choice. I mean, to be here is indeed an honor and a privilege. It, oh my God, it is. It is. And if you don't know that, wake up. Wake up if you don't know that because this realm is where you really get to create and really store up all of the goodness that you get to keep. The essence of your soul is developed on your challenges here. You know what I'm saying? And it's like that's what that's the only thing that you take with you. You don't take you don't take nothing. This right here, this is inside of me. This is within me. You know what I'm saying? So I don't hey, yo no me llevo nada. I don't take nothing. All I take is what's inside. What's inside of this little what's inside of this little shell. I don't even take this shell. I take what's inside, you know, so all of the things that I develop throughout my lifetime, that's what I take with me, and that's what matters, and, you know, my intention and my wish for all of you is that you recognize that you are a superhero, that you have it, you have it all within you to be anything that you want to be. Whatever you focus on is what you get, and I know that in your life right now, you're experiencing things that are dictating what's in your subconscious. If you're not liking what you're experiencing, you're the one who determines that change. You got to be that change. And um, y'all see how I get into these tangents and start talking about other stuff? Dang it! I was talking about Music Monday, and I was saying that young Simba King Lion has a show he's going to express himself and give you all of who he is, and share where he is and what he's going to do in the world. And Sean Dawson is going to do the same thing. And thank you, Sean Dawson, for coming and helping me give give elevation to my brother's soul. You know, thank you so much for that. That means the world to me. And you guys, I will see you guys in Puerto Rico. Oh, we're going to start, have, start having our meetings every Saturday. We're going to do our training on Saturdays. I'm going to send you guys a note, but I'm sending you all this video too, so um, just so that you could get the backup, because I'm still sending you the note, but I'm telling you on this video, it's going to be on Saturdays, because um, I have lots to share, and you guys are ready for it, and I'm excited to give it to you. Music Monday, y'all. VIM3DRadio.com. 13 love. I love you guys so much. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. Mwah.